I chose this career field because, well, of course, I love animals. Um, but in school, I always really enjoyed uh, math and science and that type of thing, um, and talking to people. I like communicating and teaching people, you know, about pet care and the best things that they can do to help their pets live their best lives. So it's a good fit for me all around. The clinic has been here for several years. Um, we haven't been seeing appointments for a little while because the previous vet left in August. So I've been here since November. Um, during the month of November, I was doing a lot of trainings and stuff, and then Captain Ryan came in shortly after I did. Um, so um, pretty much we've been seeing appointments since December. Started working in private practice. I graduated in 2015, um, and I worked in private practice up until um, commissioning just this last um, late last year. Right now, we are fairly limited. Most things are preventative medications, um, vaccines, um, just kind of your normal health checkup kind of things. Um, in the future, the plan is to begin offering more surgical services. Um, uh, spays, neuters, routine surgery procedures, um, dentistry. We're really well versed in what pets need to travel. So what type of microchips they need, what type of vaccinations they'll need for traveling to different countries, um, and health certificates. Um, you know, we do those all the time. Our regular business hours for seeing clients, uh, service members' pets is 8 a.m. to noon and then 1 p.m. till 4 p.m. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. You can find us on our Facebook page and kind of get a little bit of information about us. You can always stop on by, you know, we have staff here every day of the week except for Thursday and weekends. Um, so we've got a receptionist up front, you know, answering the phones, manning the desk so that if you have questions or any concerns, you can just come in and let us know and we'll help you out.